And so for you to manifest, you have to build up, build up in prayer. Because there is a place you pray to where there are coals of fire. That's where your tongue will be touched. And if your tongue is taught, it will be taught. When you come back, you can become a prophet. Listen, Ezekiel said in the thirtieth month, on the fifth day, I was among the captives by the river Kappa. And I saw this, I saw visions of God. He was a priest, but he was sentenced into captivity as a prisoner. But while he was there, he was not conscious about his circumstance. These are men that understood that life comes only from the regions of the spirit. Until a man travels into the crucible of life, everything he does in time is a waste. And that is why men who have journeyed through these portals, nothing shakes them. You can't break their spirit. He was among the captives. He was sentenced a prisoner. But right there in captivity, he saw visions of God. And he said as he spoke to me, the spirit entered into me and carried me to my feet. What you need to carry you is to hear the whispers of heaven. Is to hear the whispers from Zion. Your circumstance will not move. Your mountains will remain. Because the mountains only skip like rams when they come before the presence of the monarch of Zion. That's why we labor in the place of prayer. That's why we travail. That's why we worship. That by all means we may be carried. We may be carried. He said, know with this first. You cannot join in the spirit. He said, you must know this first. He said, no prophecy of the scripture. It's of individual interpretation. He said, holy men of God. They spake as they were carried by the spirit of God. What made them who they were was the ability to be carried by the spirit of God. Holy men of God. They spake as they were carried. There are people talking on earth. You can't shake anything. Because there are demons who are enthroned over the constellation. They are wielders of powers in darkness. Until you are carried. You are carried. That's where your journey began. Only men. They were speak. They speak as they were carried. As they were carried. There's a transport system in the spirit. But it's for them who can find it. It's called the path of life. That's why not many are mighty. Only few understand the technology of spirit life. There are many people laboring in hard work. Hard work doesn't make men. It is secret, secret apprehension. Apprehension of mysteries that makes men. Partnership with spirits. That's what makes a difference. And so for you to manifest, you have to build up. Build up in prayer. Because there is a place you pray to where there are coals of fire. That's where your tongue will be touched. And if your tongue is taught, it will be purged. When you come back, you can become a prophet.